Atoms are the fundamental unit of matter. They're made up of three types of subatomic particles. Protons, which are positively charged. Electrons, which are negatively charged. And neutrons, which have no charge. Protons and neutrons are located in the nucleus at the center of the atom, while the electrons orbit the nucleus. Let's take a quick look at an atom of carbon. Notice how the six protons and six neutrons reside inside the nucleus, while the electrons are shown in orbits surrounding the nucleus. The number of protons identifies the element. All carbon has six protons, and therefore six electrons. However, there may be minor variations in the number of neutrons in atoms of an element. These variations are called isotopes. It's a little difficult to show the exact location of an electron. This is because electrons have almost no mass and orbit the nucleus of the atom at incredible speeds. Therefore, their precise location at any given moment can't be determined. For this reason, electrons are often shown as a negatively charged cloud around the nucleus. However, other diagrams show the electrons as existing in rings, or orbitals. Orbitals are often used to illustrate the number of electrons at different energy states surrounding the nucleus. This is important because only the electrons at the highest energy states, or outermost orbital, participate in chemical reactions. These are called valence electrons, and they are involved in the formation of chemical bonds between atoms.